My name is Miyoung Chun. I'm a staff photographer at the Los Angeles Times. I was assigned to be a pool photographer for the O.J. Simpson trial. We captured these images by having a remote still camera mounted above the jury box. It's very crude by today's standards, but it worked. I was there Monday when the, the word came that the jury had reached the verdict. Everything came down to this moment, everything that we've been waiting for for nine months. And I had this awesome responsibility to get the photos. Everything rested on me. We, the jury, in the above entitled action, find the defendant, Orenthal James Simpson, not guilty of the crime of murder. During the verdict, Kim Goldman was just sobbing. So have it quiet in the courtroom, please. She was very emotional, so I just, you know, took a couple of frames there and then went over to the Simpsons. They were just ecstatic and just, you know, happy and thrilled. So you just have this incredible contrasting emotions in the courtroom, just, you know, aisles apart. And then I went back to OJ. I was looking for an expression and just kind of waited and waited and waited. As the jury was being excused, OJ brought his fists up, clenched them, and so he mouthed the words, thank you. Court TV didn't get that moment, so that's the only <laughs> photo that exists. And so when the verdicts were read and done, I had to go inside the courtroom to get the film. And I gave it to our motorcycle messenger and I said, whatever happens today, do not get yourself killed on the motorcycle. Just make sure you make it to the AP with the film and you drop it off. The picture running on practically every newspaper around the country and around the world, that's a pretty huge thing. That photo is among some rare ones that had that kind of notoriety, infamy, if you will, for it to be published around the world. O.J. Simpson died of cancer Wednesday at his home in Las Vegas. I heard about O.J.'s death this morning while I was on an assignment, and I thought nearly 29 years later, this moment, this picture comes back around again. It's just given another life. It's uh, kind of incredible, so it does definitely rank as probably my most famous important photo I think I've, I've made.